Um, I don't know. I've been thinking about that a little bit. They asked me that last week, but I like to take it day by day. So uh, until tomorrow night after the race, I really won't know for sure. But uh, obviously, get a little bit of outdoor riding in in the in the time off and uh, try to keep a balance between supercross and outdoor. But uh, definitely get some outdoor riding in, maybe some outdoor testing in those weeks off. But uh, mainly just gotta keep the ball rolling and. Uh, Make sure everything's still going good and we're staying on top of uh, our off-bike stuff. That's the big thing. I uh, don't want to slack off when our week's off, so, yeah. Um, I'm going to stay here in Oklahoma, or go back home in Oklahoma for about a week. Uh, do a little bit of outdoor riding up at Robbie Rayner's place, and then I'm going to go back to California and get back on the grind and try and come out swinging for Santa Clara. My time off. Uh, I'm going to spend some time here in Texas uh, with my family and my fiance back home. and. Uh, yeah, spend like a week or two here and, and take some time off, do a little riding back at my track at, in Decatur, Texas, Oak Hill, MX, and then, uh, yeah, just get back into it uh, in a couple weeks and get ready for Santa Clara and Vegas. On my time off, I um, actually headed on a cruise ship out of Gallison, Texas here on Monday. So uh, do that for like a four-day cruise and then get back to the outdoors, get, uh, get some outdoor testing in. Oh, after this round, I'm going to go back to Oklahoma, uh, relax with some family for a little bit. Um, probably try to do some outdoor testing within the first few weeks. Uh, try to get a little bit of a base for outdoors build, do some longer motos and stuff, but uh, just go back home and relax just a little bit back in Oklahoma. Uh, my time off, I'm, I'm going home for a week to kind of enjoy the family and take a little bit of a break, but, you know, cont continue to train and then uh, come back, do outdoor testing and, uh, yeah, just stay, stay ready for Santa Clara and, and get ready for Hangtown. Uh, my race break. I'm going to go to Daytona and watch that one. Uh, hang out with my family and friends. It's been a while since I got to do that. Go check out the GNCC down in Florida and just get ready for outdoors. Just start training and training a little bit differently for outdoors at least, you know, and uh, just putting in the 30 minute motos and riding and having fun, doing what I always do. So it doesn't change much. Just we're not racing on Saturdays now, but still the grind you got to do. Uh, I'm going to get some outdoor testing in. I'm going to take two to three days off next week and then go straight into outdoor. So I'll get two weeks of outdoor testing under my belt and get a good setting and then uh, get back for Santa Clara. And then after Santa Clara, I'll get to go straight back to outdoors. So uh, we don't have the longest break as the West Coast usually does. So four weeks, so uh, I get two weeks under my belt of outdoors. So that's about it. Um, I got some ribs that are a little messed up, so I'm gonna heal those up and then um, try to start riding some outdoors. Um, but the break's weird this year because we have that Santa Clara right in the middle of it all, so I don't know. Just the normal grind, I would say, mostly um, maybe two weeks outdoor riding and two weeks of Supercross. Uh, for the five weeks off, uh, probably just go right back into uh, training and riding again and uh, get set up for outdoors. I'm gonna be racing up in Canada this year, so uh, do a lot of training with uh, Garrett Swampool as my trainer and uh, do some riding with Cooper Webb. If, and uh, I guess just uh, take advantage of this time off to get uh, a little bit more fitter and stronger and then uh, come back to Santa Clara and, and then uh, on to Vegas after that. Uh, I'm just going to head back to Florida, train with uh, Timmy Ferry and the boys back there. Uh, I'm going to go pretty hard at it for a couple of weeks and then ease off a week or so before Santa Clara. Uh, I've got a few bit of, bit of work to do on a few things so I think uh, I'll knuckle down and get it sorted out before then. <laughs> Car, are you answering first? Or All right, I'll I? answer first. At the for the break, I'm gonna take some a week off and try and let my body recuperate and uh, probably put in some outdoor work and come back at Santa Clara's Santa Clara with a couple of good weeks of Supergrass and try and light the world on fire. To be honest, my plan is uh, I'm trying to get a 450 right now to do a couple East Coast rounds, and uh, if that doesn't work out, then I'll stick to the 250 and uh, get ready for Santa Clara. Uh, after the race, I'll probably take a uh, few few days off and then just uh, keep riding. I missed a few rounds, so I uh, really don't need a break. And try to find a 450. I would like to do some east rounds. Uh, but yeah, just keep riding.